Earth is a special planet. It is home to millions of living creatures. But it is not alone in this universe. It is just a tiny object among billion others in this gigantic universe. On one side, there are large bodies like the stars, planets and black holes. And on the other side, there are smaller ones like asteroids, comets and meteoroids. Each celestial body has its own path and journey in space. Some remain far from us, while some cross the path of a planet quite closely. What if any of these collide with the Earth? Will all the lives on Earth vanish? Or will we be able to protect ourselves? Along with planets, there are several other objects which revolve around the Sun and other planets too. And these objects are asteroids, comets or meteoroids. On their path, they find other planets or their moons and sometimes they even hit them. A similar incident like this happened on the Earth around 65 million years ago and that is believed to have killed off the dinosaurs. But what are these objects? Around 4.5 billion years ago, gas and dust condensed to create our solar system, which includes the sun, planets and their moons. Asteroid comets and meteoroids are the leftover from the giant cloud of gas and dust. Comet They range from a few kilometers in size to more than 10 kilometers. They are formed of ice, dust and rock. When far from the sun, they are very cold, icy dirt balls. As they approach the sun, their surfaces begin to warm up and some materials vaporize. The vaporizing gases carry small dust grains with them which form a trail of gas and dust which looks like a bright tail when seen from the Earth. They have elliptical orbits that cut across the orbits of planets. They go very near to the Sun and then farther than Pluto. During the orbit, there is a possibility that a comet can hit the Earth. One theory suggests that comets brought some of the water and a variety of organic molecules to the early Earth. There are likely to be billions of comets orbiting our Sun in the Kuiper Belt, out of which more than 3,500 comets are known to us. Asteroid Asteroids are airless rocks that are a few feet long to several kilometers. They are of arbitrary shape and the largest known asteroid is Ceres, which is about 950 kilometers wide. Most asteroids are found in the asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter. Currently, there are more than 1 million known asteroids. Occasionally, asteroids' orbital paths are influenced by the gravitational tug of planets, which cause their paths to alter. Scientists believe stray asteroids or fragments from earlier collisions have slammed into Earth in the past, playing a major role in the evolution of our planet. Meteoroid While travelling through space, asteroids sometimes collide with each other and break into small fragments. Comets also leave dust as they roam around the solar system. These breakups result in numerous small particles and fragments called meteoroids. Meteoroids are quite interesting. They range in size from dust grains to 1 meter wide. If one meteoroid comes close enough to Earth and enters Earth's atmosphere, it evaporates and turns into a meteor, a streak of light in the sky and hence also known as the shooting star, though they don't have any relation with stars. Because meteors leave streaks of light in the sky, they are sometimes confused with comets. However, these two are very different. Sometimes the meteoroids don't vanish in the atmosphere and land on the Earth's surface. When they land on the Earth, they are called meteorites. Generally, several meteoroids enter the Earth's atmosphere and are mostly harmless for us, as they end up in our atmosphere. After knowing these, we can say that the meteoroids are of the least concern for us. But comets and asteroids can be supervillains for our planet. But very small numbers of objects pass close enough to Earth and are large enough in size to become a threat for us. Scientists call them potentially hazardous objects. Any object which is larger than 150 meters and approaches Earth's orbit to within 7.5 million kilometers is a potentially hazardous object. And if these strike the Earth, then they can cause devastation on the planet. Various space agencies are keeping an eye on these objects and by knowing the size, shape, mass, composition and structure of these objects, they can find the best way to divert them. Currently, there is no danger for us from any of the known objects. 
So for now, we can sit back and watch the starry sky and enjoy its mysteries as they present them.